Although the education system has been plagued by several interruptions for nearly two years, the youngest among us are proving they are irrepressible. From all reports, the young charges at the Villa Preschool, the Simon Bolivar Preschool, and the Green Bay Preschool were all happy to return to in-person instruction. Well, they have been coping pretty well. They are happy to be at school, you know, away from home. They look forward to meeting their teachers and especially their friends. The children are glad to be back at school and they definitely they have missed their teachers. And so we are also happy to be back in, in our classroom setting. They were quite happy. One thing I must say, we, you know, we had to like get them not to the touchy part because, you know, once they see the teachers are big hugs, kisses. So, yes, for that reason, I would say, yeah, they were quite happy to be back out. Teaching public health protocols to small children is no easy feat, but masterful teachers at all three institutions have found creative ways to reach their charges. Good morning, boys and girls. How are you this morning? How are you this morning? You are looking so lovely. And today I am dressed as a wife. I am a... I dreamt to have five lunch boxes. How many? Most of our activities are hands-on. If you notice, as you look around the classroom, there are different areas with different toys. We have the block area where you find large blocks, some small. The book area where we have a lot of books. We have what we call the high school. We are learning through play. That's our motto. So everything we try to base it on a fun way. In general, learning for the young minds continues to be literally fun and games, while adults continue to face the turmoils associated with COVID-19. And so there you have it, early education truly alive and well across Antigua and Barbuda. I'm Ursula Charles Jr. for... Out of the mouths of babes.